life at the government's eavesdropping hub in Cheltenham. In the age of gun attacks on Paris and cyber attacks like the recent one on Sony Pictures, this place is very much at the front line. On his visit to Washington, D.C., David Cameron wants to make cybersecurity a number one priority for transatlantic cooperation. He wants the two countries to simulate how they cope with cyber attacks on key institutions like the Bank of England. But he also wants the president to get tough with social media giants like Facebook and Twitter, now that they seem to be how jihadists communicate and inspire each other. We need to be able, in extremis, to interrupt uh, the contact between terrorists, whether they're using fixed phones, mobile phones or the internet. We both face the same challenge and we need to work with these big companies. Uh, we have good relationships with them to make sure that we can keep people safe. But this visit also has an unspoken aim for David Cameron. His very presence in Washington, D.C. helps him to 